I would like to create the atmosphere where our home is our castle, our kingdom, and where my man is the king. And he get treated like a king. And I'm gonna be the queen. And together we're gonna be the power. So we can enjoy each other's life, support each other, treat each other with mutual respect, and just be happy with each other. Hello, this is Oksana Boychenko with you here today, and I have a gem for you. This is Marina, who is absolutely, absolutely incredible girl, and you will find out from our interview. Uh, Marina is our participant of our uh, love tour that will be here in Sacramento in May. So this is your opportunity to meet with her in person right here. And uh, But we don't need to wait for that, right? So uh, Marina, she is absolutely multi-talented, incredible, gorgeous lady who is actually right here. She lives right here in New Jersey, in the United States, and she doesn't mind relocating. So I really advise you to watch her interview all the way till the end because she has so much to tell you about herself and I guarantee you, you will not regret if you stay all the way till the end. So let me introduce you, Marina. And so Queen is in a studio here with us, Marina, today. And I am not calling her Queen just because she desires too much. No, she is really, really something, just so many things and just this one little beautiful person. So let's talk about you a little bit, huh? Marina, so you are originally from my country, Kazakhstan, yes. right? Yes. yes. I born so, and grew up in Kazakhstan. And I came to America like about like over 20 years ago. Over 20 years ago. Russia, then I came to America. So you live in New Jersey right now, right? Yes. And you're American citizen. I mean, 20 years you, you've you been living there. So, of right. course. <laughs> but so many, you know, I have a high admiration for the women who are coming from Kazakhstan because it is blend of really understanding your man because it is um, it is Oriental country, right? It is uh, It is Central Asia. So women are raised in a way to really get their men. And at the same time, they are modern and educated. So let's let's show all that. So you are psychologist, number yeah. one, right? No, that is your in psychology. Yeah, so this is your degree. This is uh, where you got the education. I mean, you are developing yourself in all of the different areas, and we will talk about that. But your passion, what do you do for a living now? Right now, I'm a licensed massage therapist. I like to make people better, to feel better. I love when people come out and go like this and say, like, ah, I have wings. It's not the Red Bull, it's the massage give them wings. Right, So, but you can, you know, what's interesting is um, you actually have the ability to combine the knowledge of that physical touch and at the same time, the combination of uh, building someone from the inside using your psychological tactics and uh, I, also, I also use a lot of like energy work. Tell us a little bit about that. It is, you know, uh, any massage therapist, a good massage therapist, there is exchange of energy is happening. You right. cannot avoid that, right? Bad massage therapists, they are just mechanical, boom, boom, pressing, like beating or whatever, right? They have true. to put all the positive, all the good energy into it. Right, so... Energy work, it's all about love. You're sending love to people. Absolutely. So you, you fulfill them not only in a physical way, but you also fulfill them with that energy, the positiveness, the kindness, the, you yeah. know, so they... Like you said, when and they I'm come out from you, like a life coach to them. You're like a life coach. Yeah. How to feel better, how to um, overall well-being. That is inc incredible. That is absolutely incredible. And uh, I know that the, um, uh, the people like you, massage therapists like you, it is very, very rare find because you are giving your 100% to people. So how long have you been? I am like to like massages to people the way I want to be treated. I always treat people the way I want to be treated. The same okay. with massages. Fantastic, wonderful. How long have you been doing this? Uh, a little bit over 10 years. 10 mm -hmm. years, so you must be really passionate about you, what you are doing. It is not just the thing to, you know, to make so, money. It's my hobby, so I, I like it. You love it, okay, fantastic. So I guess 
your husband, your man, is going to be treated really, really, really well by this hairy sure. pants. Huh? Absolutely. <laughs> All right. Um, so you um, you live right now in New Jersey, but I know you lived in like different states in the United States and also like Ohio. You lived in Ohio for a little bit, right? For yes. a couple of years or something like that and like different places. So for you, relocating to a different uh, state is not a problem. I understand. No, right? I changed three countries in my life. I changed three different states in my life, starting from the scratch. From, yeah. From the beginning. Would you consider yourself a city girl or a country girl? I think both, because I grew up in a capital, and where I live now, it's more like a country. So, so you, uh, when I was talking with you, yeah, you were saying, you know, I really don't like those crowded places. I like the space. I like the, you know, the freedom. I like, uh, you know, some area around. Well, it's nice right? to be in the nature sometimes, but you also want, you know, some going going out some places once in a while. Right. Right, right, right. But you're not the type of a girl who would want to be stuck in like small cubicle in a cosmopolitan yeah. city on some hundred floor, but in a little space. It's not you, right? Yeah, you need a some like nice area to breathe, breathe. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> okay, so um, you are gorgeous, uh, gorgeous, gorgeous girl. Uh, you're what, you're 40, 43 years old, right? Yes. 43. Um, what is your, because you don't have any kids, right? You don't have any children. It's, um, it's kind of, you know, I really love your attitude about that uh, because you were saying, you know, kids, it's such a thing that it has to be, really, you have to be with a partner to make a decision to have a child together. It is not something like you take a cat, you know, you adopt a cat. I mean, if you want to uh, take care of something, someone, take a, you, you actually do have a cat, right? You do have a cat. I have a cat named Mikey. <laughs> yeah. He's right now <laughs> <laughs> and uh you um you do I, not okay uh -huh. yeah you, you don't have that rush like i gotta get pregnant i gotta have a baby or whatever you are okay with like if it happens it happens if it doesn't it doesn't but you want to make sure that you are with a partner yeah with a partner to make the decision together right if it is happens it happens but you are totally completely fine uh, to live in a, because you're in balance, you are in a harmony, you are in love, right? I mean, you have all those things and balance within you. So you don't need something to complete you because you're already a completed person. The way I grew up, I grew up in a nice loving family where like I have like both parents who is still married for 44 years now. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. So... I would like to have a relationship that lasts a lifetime as well. So you have a right standards for the family. You have a, uh, when I have a kid. I want like both parents, like mommy and daddy, being together, mm -hmm. love each other, not just being because of the kids, but being in love as well. Right. Okay. So this is a uh, basically a decision between you and your partner that you will make together. But you're okay. You're okay either way. All right. Okay. Fantastic. Um, so you've been involved in like so many different professions uh, in your life throughout uh, throughout your life. You've been doing like you've been doing real estate. You've been a car salesperson, right? You yes. do have that. Uh, I used the, to run in my own company. You do have that in, in, entrepreneurial I spirit. In and, life for sure. What type of company did you um, uh, did you run of your own? It was a logistic company. Logistic company. Okay, so that is um uh, that is like logistic and transportation, right? Yes. Yes, uh -huh. and that was here in the United States. Yes, it was in Ohio. Uh -huh. Okay, um, so you have all those qualities of uh, you know when you when I, uh, when you said hey I was a car sales uh, salesperson which you know I couldn't imagine looking at you because car sales people I mean they call me a car salesperson because I'm like hey 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 let's do stuff right but you're like in so much harmony and balance. For me, it was, how is it possible? But you actually, you your first sales experience, you were three years old when well, you done your first sale. <laughs> I went to the dealership that I never bought the car from. So I wanted to make a difference for them. And okay. I was the first woman that they ever hired in uh, 50 years, like they've been running that place. Wow, wow, that's amazing. <laughs> Did you like that experience? 
Yeah, it was different. It was different. You always learn like new things, like trying new, like different things, like learning new things. It's very exciting. Yeah, you are a very inquisitive person about really every area of this life, right? You said that you always go to the seminars, you're always learning something. I'm like, which uh, which area do you learn things in? And you go like, in every area, like, do you learn about gardening? And you're like, absolutely, right? So you yeah. are, you, about relationship, about the garden, about energy works, about like so many things. Everything is interesting. The yeah. more you it's better for you. Absolutely, and uh, better you you actually you're growing yourself, and that helps I'll you. I say that it grows you as a person. It grows as a, you as a person, and you understand your partner a lot better as well. If you if you are knowledgeable. I, I'm interested in astrology, numerology, psychology. It helps to understand people better. Absolutely, absolutely. So yeah, you are a dream. You are a dream for every man. You know, you are ideal woman. You know, that's why we call it here, <laughs> right? <laughs> now. Let me say something else. I mean, if you haven't seen enough of the bonuses here, right? I mean, let's talk about your hobbies. Mm -hmm. You are your all ladylike, and you've been in a um, ballroom dancing and everything else. But what yeah. really shocked me, it. what really shocked me, is that you've been also using the guns and you've been like, rifle shooting and. <laughs> Since I was a kid, like I used to have a lot of boys, like my friends, and we used to run the bikes, like shooting. Well, I've been shooting professionally, actually. Like when I was exactly. in school. That like, is rifles, but targets. I don't like killing animals. <laughs> no killing animals, loving animals, loving everything that is around, but targets is, you know, totally fine. Huh? <laughs> So now uh, you've been also a professional ballroom dancer uh, as well when you were in Kazakhstan. And uh, do you do ballroom dancing now? No, right now I don't have a partner, but I would like to. If the guy knows how to dance, great. If he doesn't know, I can maybe teach him some. If he doesn't want to, maybe he can just watch me dancing. I also can do like awesome. belly dancing. <laughs> belly dancing as well. Sexy. All yeah. right. Kish. Wow. So you, um, what are the things that he can teach you? I mean, because you can teach and you know, you are calm, such a complete person into anyone's life that his life is going to be transformed in every possible way. But what is that that he can still, you, you would like to experience with him that you haven't experienced before? I never try scuba diving. That would be interesting. Ooh. Okay, so uh, you love to swim? Do you love water? I love to swim. Marina is a mermaid. That's so. how it translates, exactly. Marina translates as a mermaid. This is actually... Mermaid. This I love is the Russian name that translates as a mermaid. Yeah, okay, so you love water. That's okay. why I like, when I go on vacation, I like, to play, I like to go to the places where it's like nice and warm, where I can swim, snorkel. Okay, so snorkeling you have done. Uh, yeah. Swimming you have done. You haven't done the uh, scuba diving yet. No, not yet. Okay. So is it something that you would actually like to try by yourself? Or if your man likes scuba diving, you are willing to give it a shot and try it and, you know. Of course with somebody. Hopefully with my man. Yeah, this well, is a sport that well, actually... Five years ago, I learned how to ski. So now it's like one of my other like favorite activities. And I heard like Colorado is the best in America like for skiing. So I, I really want to try to ski in Colorado. That would be awesome. So that is down a mountain skiing, right? Down, he, yeah. down the hill, that one. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. So um, tell me, what is that that man can give you to make your life even better? Mm -hmm. it's like, I... My life is pretty good, huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you know what? My life is pretty good. Just, you know, kind of enjoying that, right? <laughs> well, people are saying, like, a woman can be strong on her own, but it takes a strong man so the woman can feel like a woman, you know? Yes. I 100% agree with you. 100%. So someone who is strong, who is confident, someone yeah. who is uh, going to feel, of course, and why I'm saying confident, because to have a, Beautiful woman like you, uh, by man's side, by anybody's side, he has to be confident because the eyes are going to be on you because you are so gorgeous. You used to be a model too, right? Even here 
in United States. I mean, back in Kazakhstan and in Russia and Russia and Europe and here in the United States. And well. even here in the United States. Yeah. And uh, you were like more uh, photo model, right? Because um, uh, you're quite short. You are what? You are five, uh, uh, five, four? Five, three. Five, three. So you're not. A, uh, I was young. I used to do also like, you know, on the run. But oh. when you're older, like, you know, and you're not tall enough, that's. Yeah, of course. Like, so you're not a run, <laughs> runway uh, model who are, you know, showing the clothes right. and stuff. But you are. So when gorgeous. I, I used to do that when I was a kid. When you were a kid, yeah. So the man has to be really confident to have a woman like you by his side. Because uh, that is, seriously, everywhere you would walk in, the eyes are going to be on you. Everybody is going to be checking you out. And man has to have the confidence enough to say, hey, you know, you can look, but she's mine, right? <laughs> and I don't care, yeah. You can, here's a handkerchief. You're drooling, okay, but she's mine. <laughs> so it does take a... Uh, confidence and really uh, with a man with a high self-esteem to, you know, to have uh, to have a girl like you and feel comfortable, you know, with someone like you. All right. So, they, you know, when I ask you this question, what is that, that he can give you? You gave me a couple of qualities. You know, you said that um, uh, that you are looking for someone who will give you the stability and protection, like, you know, the true man, the true man, the quality who, who would be loyal and faithful and those are the qualities that you describe that you are looking that you are looking in a man right mm -hmm. okay and you are you feel that you are absolutely ready for the family huh? to get absolutely. married and be happy you're ready especially in the times like where we right now with all of the chaos and everything else that is going on i think everyone feels even more need for the love and care in our life you know to be with that right person by our side to feel that hey, you know there is someone by your side you can rely on and you can you know that you are being loved and cared for so it is especially right now everyone feels more need for them uh you know for those true feelings so you're yeah you're looking for the true partnership for the true relationship you know to give 100 percent and receive 100 percent, right yes awesome well, let's get busy to get that lucky man into your life because you are ready, 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 right? Let's yes. do it. <laughs> <laughs> so now, if you want to meet this incredible girl and you really want to give her all of the love that you have, here's what you need to do. So if you have a personal matchmaker working with you right now, then contact your personal matchmaker and arrange an introduction with this incredible girl. If you do not have a personal matchmaker working with you yet, then please use the contact details below this video and at the end of this video to let us know that you have interest. So this way we can get a matchmaker assigned to you and get you introduced to this incredible, incredible lady.